folks, our hospital situation has never been more dire in my lifetime than it is right now. From staffing shortages to COVID care, Governor Andy Bashir says Kentucky's hospitals are facing unprecedented challenges. On Thursday, he reported only 90 available adult intensive care beds throughout the Commonwealth, the lowest ever during the pandemic. This shows that every hospital is bursting at the seams, that they desperately need help, and that we are a state full of more seriously sick people than we have ever seen. That's why Bashir is deploying 310 additional guardsmen to help. It brings the total to 411 guardsmen supporting 25 hospitals across the state. We will be providing non-clinical logistics and administrative support so that we can free staff uh, to focus more on patient care. And um, our mission is geared towards uh, assisting these hospitals through this current surge. Additional help is also on the way from ATA College. Bashir says 40 nursing students will support health care facilities in Louisville and across the Commonwealth. Many of our students are working in COVID units, directly working with COVID patients. Um, not only are they helping these patients, but they're learning the specific protocols and care that's required. Governor Bashir also announced more FEMA EMS strike teams are being deployed. They'll help with patient transport and care in the hardest hit areas of Kentucky. He's also opening up additional COVID testing sites to cut down on the number of people going to ERs to get tested. Number one, get vaccinated. And number two, wear a mask, right? The, the number of people who are infected uh, can directly be reduced by masking. That'll mean there are fewer people infected, therefore fewer that need hospitalization, fewer that need to be in the ICU, fewer that need a ventilator. So please do your part.